Today we're playing Aperture Desk Job. I'm sorry, I can't really pronounce that. Aperture. Yeah, you know what it is. The company, the same company that works in the Half Life universe, the Portal games, you know. However, I, w I must have been living under a rock when this game released because I totally, totally miss this game completely. It's free, it's on Steam, so if you want to try it out, I will leave the link down in the description. The game looks super funny and the graphics look super nice. So here we are, we gotta play this. Let's do this. Okay, here we are guys, a parture desk job. Let's not waste any more time, let's just see uh, controller. Hey, three, two, one. Welcome to the Aperture Science Competence Center for our most gifted employees. I'm Cave Johnson, and if you're hearing this, you are exceptional. No, don't be bashful, it's true, no false modesty. Let's get started. I know, I know, I know. Thank you for letting me know, though. Thank you for reminding me. Look at all those tubes stretching off in the distance. Every one of them's taking something important to a genius who's going to use it to change the world forever. A genius just like you. How are and you, you. Going to change the world? Well, that's up to you. History will remember what you do here today. Do not let us, and by us, I mean all of us, all of humanity, down. So congratulations, you are about to take part in the greatest science adventure at the greatest applied sciences company on earth. This is important work, and you are just the genius to do it. God gave you these gifts. I'm giving you the opportunity to use them. Well, here's your lab. I don't mind telling you, we're excited up here. Moon landing excited. Newton, Einstein. Wait a minute, that's, now you. that's not right. I think I put the wrong tape in. Hold on. Good luck. World's best science. Okay, here we go. You, in the overalls. Get to work or you're fired. Okay, I already I love this game. Overalls. Already love it. Anymore. Anyway, my name's Grady. You can call me that. I mean, let's do introductions later. You should really already be... <sighs> Honestly, I'm surprised you're not fired already. Anyway, uh, you are a uh, product inspector. That is your inspection desk there in front of you. You will be inspecting, uh, okay, uh, doesn't say. Anyway, something is going to come down the conveyor belt, whatever it is. Make sure it works. Once you've done that, keep doing that. That's the whole job. Anyway, just remember, the important thing is to have fun on your own time before you come in. Otherwise, <laughs> it's just, I don't, it's, it's real bad here. <sighs> it's fine. You'll probably be fine. Good luck. OMG, I love the voice acting, acting for that robot. Seriously, freaking love it. That is the best voice they could have ever found for that robot. Okay, what are we supposed to do? I just pressed A. Okay. Table is getting advanced. Okay, so we're inspecting a toilet. X. Pass. Okay, Y. <laughs> B. A. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're, we're toilet inspectors. I see, I see how it is. Well, does this toilet work? That's the question. This is some exciting stuff. Ooh, I have a bad feeling about this toilet. What happens if we do it not in order? Let's press B. Okay, well, it won't let me. No, oh, that actually... Oh, you see? I left the volume down. Hold yeah, on. Zip, zap, zap. That is how you inspect a toilet. I hope you were paying attention because I'm not saying any of that twice. Look, it's not rocket science. It's not even toilet science. Here's everything you need to know. See that light on the wall? If that light goes on, you're fired. <sighs> okay, good. You heard the important part. Wait, wait. Hold on. Have they all been smoking? You know what? 
It's not our job to test if the toilet's on fire, right? Just do your regular thing like normal. Move it down the line, and then it's somebody else's problem. Sounds good. Sounds good. You think your job's bad? I mean, your job is bad. <laughs> do you hear that? Hold on, I'll, let me take a look. Yeah, keep testing it. I think there's a jam. Oh shit, that actually scared me. <laughs> How do I do that? Nope, I'm just wet now. No, 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 no. That's no, just no, 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 no. Deeper no. in. It's working. Uh oh, ammunition. I mean, why not? Just test it. Get it out of here. So, first off, I I think we're in a lot of trouble here. Yep. Now, I also think we're going to be rich because I think he just admitted something. Okay. Here's shooting what toilet. You're going to do. I'm going to go work on this in secret. Just you go back and pretend to go back to work, right? Like it's got to look good. I mean, just pretend the most you've ever. You know what? Just go back to work actually. Yeah, that works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds good to me too. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. How do you, how are you liking this game so far? I'm absolutely in love with this game. This is like a hilarious movie. Oh shit, I didn't even press anything. What's going on? Six months later. And we're still here. Hey, I'm back. Yeah, I'm back. Hey, uh, welcome back. First off, you did awesome pretending to calibrate all those toilets. The best. All right, are you ready for this? Presenting. Press, you gotta press the button. Pres presenting oh, the oh, oh, Aperture oh, oh. Science Turret. Go on, take it for a Hell second. yeah. The controls are right there on your desk. Well, I'm trying yeah. to. And I haven't even showed you the best oh, part. Oh, oh, Here's oh, the best oh. Part. Left trigger to open the wings. Shooting. You know what, though? I, I mean, tried to shoot him. I'm going to kill yourself <laughs> with that point at you like that. So let me just turn it around. Alright, Oh, again. snap. Don't, it's safe. I mean, this time. This time it's safe. Last time it wasn't. You almost died. Damn, that is so cool. Go on, shoot. Now go die this time. I... Wow! Uh -oh. Holy moly, man. That is great! Oh, man. The turret broke. That was the only one, too. But don't even worry about it. Because here's what I've actually been working on. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, okay. Mark two. This is what I spent most of the six months on. It was one month for the first turret, and then like five for this bad boy. Oh man, you gotta take my picture with this. Uh, the desk <laughs> should have a camera built into it. F12. Okay. Are you taking the picture? Okay, good. Moment recorded for all the history books. Now Hell like yeah. You! Are gonna take it for a spin. Here, let me turn it around. Okay, oh, we're shit. Do everything, but I think you get it. Holy let's just shit. Open everything at once and see what happens. Yeah, let's fucking do it. I'm pressing everything right now. I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, quite a bit is falling off. Keep shooting. You're not doing I'm this. trying this to, I'm trying to. Engineering problem. It's on me. You're doing great. No, no nothing is working. That that's working. Oops. <laughs> it even looked cheap when I bought it. I remember looking at it like, ah, spend the extra dollar. And yep, here we are. 
Oops. Oh, okay, that works. Don't know how I did that, but... Oh, oh. Uh oh, I think we're in big, big trouble. Wow. All right. That, Whoopsie some daisy. Of the stuff I put on there just didn't work. Most of it, like 90%, or even higher maybe. But some of it worked great. Mm -hmm, so all mm -hmm. we have to do is keep the great stuff, and then we, then we can. So, okay, that's the police. So <laughs> that's the one police. Of us needs to streamline this turret, right? And one of us needs to take the fall for shooting up the warehouse. Because there this is a lot of damage and they're gonna look into this. <laughs> which job which job do you want? How about I fix a turret and then you take Yeah, I'll do that part. Remember, if anyone asks, you don't know me, okay? <laughs> don't say anything. <laughs> How come this is like the best game I've ever played and I didn't even know it existed? God damn, this is good. This is, this is, seriously, this is hilarious. I love this. Love this narrative comedic games. Absolutely amazing. We're in prison with the control table. Okay. Hey, well, I mean. Well, wow, howdy ho. You are the best. Thanks for keeping your mouth shut and doing your time. I mean, 18 months way later more time than either of us were expecting I don't know what was in those boxes we blew up but they were wow were they mad anyway I promise you're not going to regret this oh now I'm activating the toilet Even that the offender has faithfully observed the rules of the institution offender has been granted supervised early release please sign for your possessions inmates possessions are as follows desk one Inmate must state their name, print their name, then sign their name. Okay, and okay. So state your name into the desk. Slim Bratsky. Inmate's name is now preserved for the permanent record as Slim Bratsky. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Moving on. Now, sign your name. Oh, 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 mouse to sign, okay. It looks pretty good, As right? As a condition of right? supervised early release, parolee and desk agree to report within 15 days. Hey, don't listen to her. Ah, about reporting to your sneaky, parole sneaky. Guess who spent the last 18 months getting his probation agent license through the mail? Yep, me. That's right. I'm your parole officer. I mean, not just you. I'm managing like seven guys on parole right now, but they're basically reintegrated back into society. Well, not Tony. He's struggling a little, but anyway, that's all I was doing. I got something to show you. Let's get out of here. It is never too late to met. You are both free to go. Oh, uh, bring your desk. <laughs> roger, roger, I'll bring my freaking desk. Anything for you, buddy. Just because you have such a beautiful voice. Okay, I streamlined the turret while you were gone. Introducing the Mark III. Ta-da! So Ooh. I got rid of all the ones that fell off and just kept the stuff that worked. I mean, it was totally over-engineered, so it just does one thing now. It shoots. It didn't need a satellite dish. That was just dumb. Here, yeah, that was pretty dumb. The appliances I found, they were just lying around in the housewares research department in, in a locked room. Oh. I like that tattoo on your neck. Did you do it yourself? Like a, is it a dragon holding a knife? <laughs> I got a freaking dragon tattoo in my neck now. Of course I do. Because then we'd be tattoo bros. Anybody would look at us and know we are friends. You think you give me the same tattoo? That'd be weird. 
Definitely give you the same tattoo. Alright. Damn, this is hard to aim. So you got the dragon and the knife. Mine similar, but more robot themed. Man, that'd be so cool. Oh, speaking of being cool, I've got something even better to show you. Show me, show me. I'm ready. Controls. Oh. It's really easy. Just pick up the desk, tilt it around to aim, and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. And you shoot with the right trigger like normal. Go on, try it. No, oh, I don't have the Steam Deck. It's real easy. Just pick how much did the tattoo hurt when you gave it to yourself. Did you have the proper tools? I Can I shoot anything else? Have a big you probably had to heat up a pin with a lighter or something. That sounds, I mean, oh. that sounds pretty awesome. Another tattoo idea I just had instead of a robot hand coming out holding a wrench. Like a skeleton. Yeah, so you're looking at it like, what's he trying to say? Is he human on the inside, or does he have like a? Skeleton? Oh, they're flying. Have they always been flying like that? I didn't see them until now. That's the one I want. So when we get three minutes, I'll find a pin and we can heat up that light. All right, everything checks out. This thing is. Oh my god, I just want to see what the game brings to me next. To here. So, I was saving the best for last. Oh hell yeah. While you were in jail, I got us a meeting to show our turret to Cave Johnson. That's right, the owner of the what? company. No what? Pressure, but if he likes this, he's gonna make us rich forever. Are you ready? Let's I'm ready. Go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Are you guys ready? Is it burning? What are you gonna do with your share of the money? I know what I'm gonna do is pay off the money I borrowed to make this turret. <laughs> like immediately pay it off. Yeah, that sounds good, bro. Right, that sounds I mean, good. Phew, I'll be in some real trouble. Oh Plus shit! I'll have to pay that too. Does it make sense to you that the VIG is more than what I borrowed in the first place? It doesn't seem like it. It's whoa, 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 whoa. Somebody overrode the controls. Hold on. Is there gonna be some action now? Huh. <gasps> That's one of the appliances I stole from housewares. Oh, oh, I knew it. I can do anything. Damn it. Good thing I brought a couple of spears. There we go. There we go. Got no chance. Got no chance. Who's shooting? Who's shooting? They're never gonna stop ambushing us. Oh, I, I can't mean, aim down. I can barely hear what you're saying, bro. I'm in the middle of a fight here. I really think they're gonna keep coming for, like, basically forever. Okay, so what the hell do you want me to do, bro? Housewares, man. Can you believe it? Those guys are such pieces of... I don't know, man, what they would do, except for steal their stuff. I knew you were gonna wake up. I knew you were gonna wake up. Oh shit, hello. Hello. Yeah, hello. Oh, I see, I see, I see. <laughs> Bye bye, suckers. Nice work. I got the elevator working again, but we have another 80 floors before we get to cave. We're not gonna survive 80 in 
ambushes in a row. Your desk should have some buttons on the underside of it. Those fire the rockets that got built into the desk. They put them Ooh. on there, Stander, now, for safety reasons. So, if you hit all four buttons at once, it should rocket us up to all 80 levels real fast, and then up through the floor of Cave's office. Automatic death launch sequencer engaged. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. Nine, eight, seven. You okay there, buddy? Okay, really nice work. Good shooting. I think we're good from here. They probably gave up. I have given up <laughs> by now. <sighs> okay, let's go show this thing to Cave. Also, I do have one quick confession. I didn't actually get an appointment with Cave Johnson. I lied about that. Mm, okay. But it turns out, I didn't know this, it turns out nobody's seen him in years. I did know it when I lied to you about our appointment. But it was still pretty new information. Anyway, I'm not gonna lie to you anymore. <sighs> I think he might be a millionaire recluse now. So be ready for that. There might I'm be ready for anything then. Hello, Mr. Johnson? What the frick? Frickity Kaduka? Mr. Johnson, are you here? Hey there. It's me. Hello? Hey Johnson. No, no, not behind the giant head. I am the giant head. I'm gonna level with you. A few years back, I got real sick. Body riddled with disease. I was a goner. Threw every dollar I had at it. Told those eggheads, hey, eggheads, make me live. God, I wanna shoot something. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers on Earth a blank check to make you immortal, and this is what they came up with? A giant head? <laughs> that's, that's pretty stupid, oh, man. By a mile. No. They figured out how to put my consciousness in a computer. That's what's in the giant head. Their first plan was to put me in a regular brain-sized computer. Then they'd put that in a robot body, and hey, presto. Well, turns out you can't fit an entire human mind in a computer that small. All I could do was tell time and know what my name was. So, they kept making it bigger. Big enough to cram every last bit of me into this thing. What happened to my robot body? Still under the head, somewhere, all crushed up. Couldn't support the weight. So the lab boys put me in the big head, switched me on, and, uh, I don't know, I panicked. Killed a few of them. Said I'd kill more <laughs> if they ever came back. Honestly, I, I regret that now. Anyway, that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Get their butts up here and end my suffering. Hey, hey, hey! I can't talk over the sound of you shooting me. Go hey, hey, okay, 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 okay. Head or not. Right. Hey, you already told me, man. Giant head, riddled with disease, eggheads, immortality. Started with the small head, it got bigger. Ah, now I remember. Anyway, that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Mm hmm. Get their butts up here and end my suffering. Now, don't worry about me. It's been a full life, but we're done here. I'm itching for the next step. Heck, I'm excited about it. Don't even think of it as killing me. You're breaking me out of prison. I'm just dead. Oh, snap. Okay. I need you to crack this big clay head open so I can spill out into the universe. So, what do you two eggheads got? Uh, you, uh, you are in luck. We actually came up here to show you our new invention. Good stuff. Let's see it. Show them, partner. Whoa, that'll work. I'll be honest, I thought you were two lunatics who dragged a toilet up here. But you are geniuses. <laughs> he called us geniuses. Hell yeah. Let's spray paint this face real good. What? Oh, of course. You're made of metal, sir. So shoot the metal. Working. In the head, 
I can't see. It's working great, sir. It doesn't feel like it's working, but in the egg head. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> hey, you see that? I think that's his power source. Oh, here we go. Powering down. The great big Goodbye. Boy, I'll, I'll give you two credit. That is one hell of an invention. You did it. You figured out how to end my suffering. All right. Suffering ended in three, two. Ah. Uh. Oh, that was way more intense than I thought it would be. Backup power activated. Oh shit. Uh, you're both fired. I'm gonna need your key cards. Just lay them down in front of the head. Not too close to the chin, or I won't be able to see them. <laughs> uh oh. Well, goodbye again, Mr. Clark. just occurred to me that the only person who knows Cave Johnson asked us to kill him is now dead. Yeah. Do you know what the punishment for murder is? They told us in parole officer school, you're not going to like this. Uh, it's life. Your whole life in uh -oh. prison. We should. Yeah, we, we, we should leave. Don't touch anything. And bring the desk. Damn, this is one weird game. And I love it. Absolutely love it. I'm like, baffled how, how good this game is months later. Morning, Charlie. It's me, Gary. Gary, your boss. Keep inspecting those toilets. Good work, good stuff. Good. Hey, it's just me, Grady. Yeah. Just like yesterday. Man, this witness protection program is great. I don't know why we didn't turn state's evidence against those loan sharks in the first place. We don't have to pay any of the money back. We got cool new names. I like yours a lot, by the way. Oh, he got the tattoo. He got the tattoo. You know, come to think of it, <laughs> you think they'd move us to another state or give us new jobs or something. Feels like everything is exactly the same, except our first names. Ah, you know what? They know what they're doing. Anyway, see you tomorrow, Charlie. <laughs> oh, he's still alive. Damn it. What's that thing? Can I can I do anything? Oh. Oh oh oh. I control the toilet somehow. I don't know what button I'm pressing. No, okay, now I'm not controlling that. Beautiful, beautiful. What a magnificent short little game, guys. Absolutely loved every second of this game. If you want to check this game out for yourself, guys, I will leave the link down in the com in the description. And if you like this game, let me know down in the comments and I will try and find more awesome games like this and play for you guys to enjoy. Guys, thank you so much for watching this with me. Until next time, keep on staying freaking fucking ucky bucky awesome.